Hello, my beautiful friends. Welcome. My name is Christina Marie. I do do beauty reviews, tutorials, unboxings, and giveaways. I have a bunch of different giveaways going on right now. Make sure to check them out. I will put links that take you to the videos that talk about how to enter all those giveaways in the description box down below. If you've been a subscriber of mine for a while now, you know that I love Juvia's Place eyeshadows. They are all so pigmented. So I come to you today with another review of one. And today is on the Masquerade Mini. But when I say mini, I mean, look at the size of this palette. Look at these 16 shadows. Amazing. So what I've done, I've created multiple looks for you guys. And I'm gonna go in and swatch all of these and then let you know my thoughts. So let's dive in to the swatches first. Chai is a super pigmented purple blue color. Mally is this really pretty emerald green shimmer. Delia is this gorgeous royal blue shimmer. Zola is this really pretty aqua blue shimmer. Makeda is a vibrant purple shimmer. Zobo is a maroon matte that I found to be a little patchy. Calabar is a stunning maroon shimmer. Bori is this pink shade that has a little bit of shimmer to it. Lisa is a pale pink shimmer that I use as an inner corner highlight a lot. Burkina is a brown matte that I use as a transition color. Cairo is a copper shimmer. Ada is a burgundy matte that I use as a crease and outer corner buildup color. Ahaya is a light brown shimmer that I use as a brow bone highlight. Zula is a brick matte shade that I use in the crease and outer corner buildup. Casablanca is this gorgeous brown shimmer. Alimi is a brown matte that I use as a crease and outer corner buildup. Now let's dive in to each of the day's looks. I started off by priming the eyes, and then I went in with the brow balm shade of Geyser. I did the transition shade Burkina, and crease and outer corner buildup of Falani. For the outer corner lid, I used Delilah. Inner corner lid, I used Zola. Inner corner lid, lower lash, I used Zola again. And then I did the rest of the lower lash in Burkina. I started off by priming the eyes, and then I went in with a brow bone shade of Dahaya. For transition shade, I used Burkina. For crease and outer corner build up, I used Zulu. Inner corner lid, I used Molly. Center lid, I used Delilah. Outer corner lid, I used Chai. Inner corner lower lashed, I used Molly. Center lower lash, I used Delia. Outer corner lower lash, I used Chai. I started off by priming the eyes, and then I went in with the brow bone of Delia. For transition shade, I used Burkina. Creased and outer corner buildup, 
I used Falani. Inner corner lid, I used Geisa. Rest of the lid, I used Makata. For inner corner lower lash, I used Geisa. And then the lower lash for the rest of it, I used Makita. I started off by priming the eyes, and then I went in with the brow bone of Sahaya. For transition shade, I used Burkina. For creased and outer corner buildup, I used Sobo. Inner corner lid, I used a Haya. Rest of the lid, I used Calabar. Lower lash waterline inner corner, I used Geisa. And the rest of the waterline, I used Zobo. I started off by priming the eyes, and then I went in with the brow bone of Dahaya. For transition shade, I used Burkina. For crease and outer corner buildup, I used Soba. Inner corner lid is Geisa. Rest of the lid is Bori. Lower lash inner corner is Geisa. Rest of the lower lash is Bori. I started off by priming the eyes, and then I went in with the brow bone of Dahaina. Transition shade is Burkina, and crease and outer corner buildup is Ada. Inner corner lid is Dahaya, rest of the lid is Cairo. Lower lash inner corner is Dahaya, mid lower lash is Burkina, and the rest of the lower lash is Ada. I started off by priming the eyes and then I went in with the brow bone with the shade of Dahaya. For a transition shade, I used Burkina. For crease and outer corner buildup, I used Falani. For the very inner corner, I used Geisa. And then right next to that, I used Molly. For the rest of the lid, I used Casablanca. For lower lash inner corner, I used Geisa. And the rest of the lower lash, I used Burkina. Which of the looks were your favorite? I would have to say the one that had the green and the blue and the purple was my absolute favorite. I used that for a date night for with my husband. It was our anniversary and I think it turned out really good. All the shimmers in here worked great. Um, this Casablanca I use all the time as an all over co uh, lid color. Um, just watch out for a little bit of fallout on that one. All the shimmers, I always use my fingertips to apply. The mattes, I had some problems with. Um, let's go back to the shimmers for a second. Just this Molly right here. It's not as pigmented as the rest of the shimmers. And then the Bori, it could be um, a little bit patchy. Now for the mattes, some of the mattes were pretty patchy on me. And the two mattes that did it the worst were this Ada color here and then Zula color here. I loved using Geisa as an inner corner highlight all the time. Um, Dahaya as a brow bone color. And I used Burkina as a transition uh, color in a lot of them. And then for a crease and out of corner buildup, I used Falani in a lot. So it's 20 five dollars for this palette this is the mini so imagine the bigger size i mean you would never go through those in a lifetime but i really really do love it i love 
Juvia's Place eyeshadows. I think this is one of their better palettes. I think it's more versatile that you can get a lot of use out of it. So I would highly recommend this one. If you like this video hit that like button if you haven't subscribed yet do it does really mean a lot to me when you like subscribe you got to be subscribed to win to those giveaways uh, hit that notification bell so you know when our next video will be posted as always you guys have a beautiful day and I will see you soon bye